Good morning. I am going to talk to you about packing right now. I actually got dressed for this presentation. Um, so I'm going to show you what we are not doing this outside because I have been warned that people can grab your backpacks here and luggage. So we will not tempt them. Um, so I have three big things that I travel with and you know travel light yeah right you try traveling full-time permanently and travel light I like to have more than my pajamas in one dress to wear so the first case I have is highly impractical is this beautiful leather backpack I got in Mexico for $85 and I have my computer bag, which is hidden in there. So that gets filled up. Then I have equipment in there. And my latest new thing is this rolly guy. So I have to carry all of these items myself because it's not wise to be so laden down that you have to hire someone to help you. But I just want you to know that I am constantly challenged by traveling light. Like I said, I like to have more than two things to wear and I'm working on the road so I need my equipment. <sighs> so I challenge you to keep it to two or three items. And you know, I used to, when I didn't have my computer, travel with a carry-on bag that I could get on the plane for six months with. I can no longer do that. Uh, but I'm pretty happy with my luggage right now, even though it's heavy. And I'm going to be moving in two days to the ocean from Phnom Penh to the coast. So I will see you over there. Have a lovely day. P.S. I forgot to tell you. I also travel with my yoga mat. This goes everywhere with me because you never know what you're going to have to sit on or, more importantly, um, I always have a surface to do my yoga and meditation on. And that goes on top of everything. <laughs> no one has tried to take it away from me yet when I get on the plane and am totally over what you're allowed. Oh tip for that. Just pretend you didn't see the sign that says you're only supposed to have one carry-on. Because you know what I noticed when I got onto the Air Asia flight to come to Phnom Penh? Many people had two items as well as me. And um, so no one stopped them. So I advise to push the limits with the boundaries of what you can carry on. What are they going to do? Throw it out when you get on the plane? They're not. So as long as you can wedge it into the door, I have never had them take my shit away. Ah. <sighs>